Hey, I'm Littlefoot, and today we're watching The Land Before Time. Rar XD. Rar, like the video. Like the video, and we'll watch dinosaurs. Click the join button for free con- Not free. Just click the <laughs> join button for exclusive content and also the full recording. And subscribe for Dinosaur. I'm genuinely so excited. This is one of my most watched movies probably as a kid. Oh, this movie does have a pretty hard intro. Does it start with the meteor hitting or does it end with the meteor hitting? <laughs> That's how the last Land Before Time movie will end. I thought there was only one Land Before Time. What do you- There's so many. There is 14. Yeah, they've made like a million direct to DVD movies. Did you know that one of the reasons why organisms getting smaller over time is because there's less oxygen in the air. So creatures with more blood have a harder time oxygenating their blood because there's less oxygen I in like the air. I like the gorgeous, beautiful orchestral score grew in intensity as you were talking and rambling and completely drowned you out. For the wolf, the bison, the whale. The Whale, the movie? Before Brendan Fraser's career. <laughs> this is back when Brendan Fraser was still a successful leading man. Some had flat teeth and ate the leaves of trees. Have you seen the theory that the way we draw dinosaurs could be wildly unrealistic? I just think it's because they're woke. They're making all these dinosaurs have feathers and be colorful. They're making them gay now. Is there nothing sacred? <laughs> I wasn't even like a kid who loved dinosaurs. Really? Your princess poster makes me think that you liked a lot of things that boys typically like and not girls. <laughs> Whenever like, the teacher said like, okay, if you want to watch this movie, go to this class. You were with all the girls watching 16 Wishes while all the guys were watching Land Before Time. Uh, 16 Candles? Just to clarify, I know neither of the things you are talking about right now. 16 Wishes f***ing sweeps. What the f*** is 16 Wishes? 16 what Wishes is, what is not 16 sweep? Wishes. It's Debbie Ryan. It's Littlefoot. It's Littlefoot. Licking his ass, too. What the f They gotta clean him because they got all that placenta on them. The placenta. Mmm. Would you eat the placenta? Dude, this movie is beautiful. Like, it's so well animated. It's just really cute. I just love the character designs. It's like prehistoric Bambi. But also the music is so atmospheric. It's actually fucking awesome. It's beautiful, yeah. It really sucks that like the editor's gonna have to like cut out all the music when we talk <laughs> over it. Just take our word for it. It's really beautiful. <laughs> Don Bluth was pretty based because he was literally at Disney. It was like, man, the movies that you guys are making suck ass. And then he poached a bunch of talent and left and went and made his own movies and then beat Disney's ass in the box office so hard that they started making the Renaissance movies because they were like, we have to get our act together. That's crazy. That's so badass. But then he failed after that. <laughs> Oh, the tree stars, yes! I used to call the leaves the tree stars, bro. You're a nerd. Fuck you. I can't be a cute little kid. And I bet you used to call candles 16 Wishes by Debbie Ryan. <laughs> yeah, I did, okay? I love 16 Wishes by Debbie Ryan. Have you ever seen the Great Valley? No. I like how, like, the backgrounds are just gradients. It's very abstract. <laughs> Somebody in chat said this movie was rotoscope. They got footage of real dinosaurs and drew over them, bro. That's crazy. Three horns never play with long necks. Oof. Okay, pick your side in the race war. Okay, who's not going with the long neck? One horn's enough for me. When we reach the Great Valley, there will be many, many long necks for you to play with. This movie's Littlefoot solves racism because all of his friends are like the different races of dinosaurs. I never even understood that as a kid. This is what it feels like to grow up in a mixed community in America. The T Rex, bro. Oh no. Oh, the fear. Oh my god. Why's that dinosaur got such an evil phrenology? This guy freaked me out as a kid. The red eye is so creepy. This is the same as that weird Ewok movie I keep <laughs> thinking about, bro. Run! Run! These dinosaurs are underage. Stop sniffing them, you freak. Do you think T-Rexes were like really that bad? Like, I feel like they probably get like a bad rep. Like if I had like tiny little arms like that, I'd be a little insecure and maybe kill people too. Well, this is Dr. Dis T-Rex. Oh shit. This entire movie is like if the Rite of Spring segment in Fantasia was actually good. I don't remember. Exactly, because that one sucks. Herds were divided. 
families were cut in two. Well, the first dinosaur was discovered in 1820-22. So George Washington did not know about dinosaurs. His ass was stupid. This is just Bambi for Gen Z. Like, I'm kind of over it. But aren't we Gen Z? Oh my god, you're right. I fing love this movie now. Oh. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, your mom kind of got her ass beat today. Like, she's not feeling too hot. Do you remember the way to the Great Valley? And you know my 12-year-old ass was crying when I watched this. Littlefoot, let your heart guide you. This is so beautiful, though. Like, if we're being serious for a second, this is fucking amazing. It's gorgeous. If I watched this alone, I probably would have cried. Well, thank God we're here to keep you all right, Jack. You ain't crying with me around. <laughs> you will never feel a real emotion as so long as we're here. A new emotion, ambivalence. <laughs> Woo! It's all her fault. All whose fault? Mother's. See, they're playing the beautiful chorus because it's heavenly. His mother died. But what he doesn't know is that dinosaurs don't go to heaven. They go to hell. Straight to the fiery pits of Gehenna. You'll never be apart. For you are still a part of each other. This movie teaches you about death, bro. This is kind of crazy for a kid's movie because every fucking kid's movie nowadays ends with a fake out death. But this movie and Bambi are like, hey, your parents are going to fucking die one day, little kid. Deal with it. Yeah, I'm trying to think of the last modern kid's movie I saw that actually kills a character of any significance that isn't a villain. Coco? That would be bullshit if she lived. <laughs> she should have died years ago. Forgot about the Great Valley and that he must somehow reach it. What's up? dog that baby pterodactyl looks delicious bro like it looks like a mini roast chicken put that shit in my air fryer man <laughs> this is what motherfuckers who get their first apartment are like oh wow this place looks great to go to sleep little divot in the floor it's kind of nice here this cost ten thousand dollars ten thousand in nyc wait mother Oh my god, he went up to his shadow. No, little kid, that's your shadow. You're stupid. <laughs> You're stupid. Little foot more like fucking little brain. Holy shit. He would have to find his way. Ducky, but his friend Ducky's there. Be broken. Sarah! Oh, never mind. I don't remember any of these characters' names. Ducky's the one that looks like a duck. I don't know what a duck looks like. I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay, I hate to say it, but the color of their skin changes like a fucking JoJo. Yeah, she was green like 10 seconds ago. Eat your fucking leaf, bro. Where are you taking that shit? But Dude, that's the leaf the his star. mom gave him. That's the old McDonald's my mom bought me before she passed, bro. I'm gonna be carrying that shit. Actually, you could. My moldy fry, bro. Well, they wouldn't get moldy. It's McDonald's. Hello. Oh, Ducky. Oh, he's so sad. Oh, it's the most depressed protagonist in <laughs> anything we've ever seen. I lost my family in the big earth shake. Dude, this movie is extremely fucking depressing, dog. <laughs> Dude, being a dinosaur fucking sucks. <laughs> oh, we got Petrie. Here he is. Petrie Blackface. This is my favorite character, bro. Your favorite character is the one who does blackface in the first frame that they show up. Uh, I, I flied? No. You followed. He's like a Donald Duck prototype. Literally. Do you think someone's made like a Disney family tree when he's like related to Donald Duck somehow? <laughs> How long ago were dinosaurs? Was it like a hundred million years ago or like 10,000? Well, they're still voting. Core, that was such a topical joke. Core told that fucking joke in black and white, bro. <laughs> With a fucking cigar in his mouth. And a top hat looking ass. Did you just say 10,000 years ago for dinosaurs? LMAO. Dude, shut up. Dude, y'all think y'all think I stole the dinosaur book when I was in first grade and I don't remember when dinosaurs were alive? I regret stealing the book, but I'm gonna tell you right now, I read the book, okay? You didn't just steal it for the pictures? Core, core, stop. You're literally exposing me right now. You need to <laughs> chill out, dude. Ooh, mother present. Very important. Oh, yes. Uh, I keep safe. No leaf on planet <laughs> Earth has ever been this durable. They literally folded it into the joint wrapper. <laughs> He's gonna light that shit up. What's the best way to get it over trauma? Getting Not therapy. To marijuana. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking pose! It looks like they're giving birth right now. Frightened? <laughs> Me? I like how like wrinkly and ugly they are. Yeah. They're really ugly. I think the person who made this movie secretly hated dinosaurs. Do you 
Dear brave Sarah. Dear brave Sarah. That's not my Sarah, dude. My Sarah's Michael, personally, but whatever. Maybe Michael Sarah evolved from the Freehorn. Someone's gonna make the Michael Sarah family tree in 100 million years ago. It's gonna have this dinosaur. Michael Sarah and Petrie had a baby. His name was Michael Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> Michael Sarah gave birth to himself. Hello? Oh, yeah, this guy. Spike, yes. God, this movie's so cute oh man this is like the perfect movie for like a very very long bus ride and you don't watch this movie on like a phone or anything this movie was the laptop dvd this movie was for those lucky fucks who had a tv in their car and my dad had a minivan with one of those it was so good you were one of those lucky fucks it does not agree anything Nope, nope, nope. Join up with the fucking long tails, bro. I don't think the long tails like mess with them. I think their tails Ooh. are too short. Oh yeah, they probably discriminate based on the size of the tail. You're right. Your four looks so ridiculous. <laughs> 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 the delivery of that was so funny. <laughs> All right, Spike. Not too fast. Whoa. Yeah, how are you fat in like the Paleolithic era or whatever you call and it? And he was just born. Bro <laughs> was born fat. Some babies do be like that. They come out and they're like, damn, that is one fat baby. That kid gonna be a sumo wrestler. <laughs> I fight. This is so nostalgic. It actually <laughs> hurts. I can get my own green food. Someone in chat just pointed this out, that the dialogue says you fly. Yeah. They're saying shit grammatically incorrect because they are kids. That's the funny. And I'm not afraid of sharp tooth. My God, the look on her face is so evil. Like, hello? I don't think anyone's inherently evil, but that fucking dinosaur might be, bro. I don't know about that one. If I were to say someone was inherently evil, I don't know. I think I might have a couple guesses. He's like, oh, is this where the depressed people sleep? You may be <laughs> depressed, but at least you sleep quietly. So I'm gonna go over here, all right? The worst part about this is that, like, you could probably rotoscope this movie to make all these just fat, gross, naked people. <laughs> That's how you ruin my childhood in, like, one minute, dude. <laughs> The stakes are so real in this film. The movie is a bunch of kids who are homeless who try and find food. They finally get one bite to eat and immediately are on the run for their lives. That's nature, bro. Next, they're gonna go to the watering hole and hippos are gonna come out and wanna eat them alive. Come on, get up. We're going the right way. I was watching like Baki recently and like there's a character that like caveman from prehistoric times who like kills dinosaurs. <laughs> what the f*** is Baki about, bro? <laughs> It's the wrong way! Who says? My mother! Then she was the stupid line of two. Take that back! Fight! 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 fight. Ah. Let him wait! That's what we're gonna start calling core. It's not based on my head. My it's like a letter opener. <laughs> The kids are so authentic. The voices are so good. Yeah, they got child actors and they're actually like all good. That's insane. Oh my God, he's literally an obsidian like on some Minecraft shit right now. Without a diamond pickaxe, that's gonna take so long to break. You're done for, kid. <laughs> This movie's crazy, bro. These kids are about to die. I wouldn't even be surprised because this movie's depressing as hell. Like, all the kids just die at the end of the movie. And then it shows up with, like, white text with a black background saying, You will die one day. And then all the kids start crying. <laughs> That's the original ending. This movie is terrifying. Why did I watch this? I was such a pussy as a kid. And I like when them disguised as the monster came and they played a musical theme that was intimidating, but was still playing like the main like hero theme. Get out of my way. <laughs> Bro, there should have been like a banana peel there, like just to make it worse. <laughs> If you get rid of the dinosaur features, there's just like a human fat baby face with this character and it trips me out. It looks like that one Looney Tunes bald guy or whatever. Ah, sharp tools. That prehistoric water must taste so good, bro. Dude, there's no microplastics at all in that. It looks like Baja Blast. Maybe prehistoric water was just the consistency of Baja Blast. 
Is that a sirloin steak? How hungry am I? I'm <laughs> looking at rocks. How hungry am I? <laughs> Dude, the trumpets are crazy. Do you hear that? Fart. I'm flying. I'm flying. The character arcs, man. This is Ice Age, but good. I figured it out. Oh my god, Petri fake out death, let's fing go. But this movie actually kills people, so it might not be a fake out death. Some would say that this was the original fake out death. Well, wasn't Hitler the first fake out death? Because he's still in Argentina, so. Dude, he's not in Argentina, bro. He's in Cuba. Oh shit, last time I. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what, you went over his house? You're checking up with him or something? What the? <laughs> What a beautiful shot. Did this movie make one billion dollars because it deserves it? And it, it brings a smile to my face. In home video sales? Probably. Mother! Don't go, mother! Don't go! Not my last vape cloud. This is me when the fing jewel dies. Oh my god, it's the Great Valley. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. Yep, yep, yep. We did it! We did it together! I think some people did a little bit more than others. Definitely. I mean, like, Sarah was kind of, like, on the opposite team for 90% of the movie. And grazing upon them, their families. Aww. This one holds up so well. It's just there's certain elements of it that will always be timeless because it's artistry first, movie yeah. second, to be honest, for better or worse. The music is majestic, bro. Not to be that guy, but we used to be a real country, bro. Why does this happen every time we watch a 2D animated movie released before 1995? Because it reminds us of what the potential is when you're not just trying to make as much money as possible with spending as little money as possible all the fucking time with everything. Every fucking industry. Long ago. Aw, this is so cute, man. It just puts a smile on my face. It's such a cute ending. If Don Bluth was in my area, I'd pass him the blunt. The middle line on the H slowly angles and then moves <laughs> next to the T. John Blunt. Or, <laughs> John Don. Blunt. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys want us to watch more Don Bluth movies, and perhaps... Wait, Diana Ross sings this song? Sorry, if you guys want us to watch more movies featuring Diana Ross, like the video and comment down below <laughs> that. Adam Sear, Aramir, Ali Aling, Alpha Dog, Alzheimer's is a bad disease. We should cure it. Arachnidroid, Aaron Tateson, Barsom, Bento, Castlemaster, Caden Field. Fallen Berliner, Hamlu, Cosmic Diga, Daddy Diarrhea, Dante Estevan, Diablo Chiquita, Dixie Dominator, Dan, Fletch Trollage, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Grenados, George White, George White, Gub Stargazer, Helio, Hummus, Isaiah Alfred, Kai Hell, Lilac Moon, Lovely Fish, Michael Rodriguez, Mr. Marcus Blitz, Merrick, Native, Omega Waffles, Penny Pen Pen, Please Gamers, Pop Belly Man, Queen Maggie, Rabbit of Carabinon, Ardizel, Ryan Thompson, Rocky Road with Sprinkles, Rathoka, Saul Goodman, Sir Kaiju, Filling the Pilk, Tatiana, Tyrion Sills, Trazan, Val Explicit, Victoria, Whimsy, Wolves Rain, Valenti, Bishalom, Pat Kilgore, Trinity Martin, Eden Michelle, K Mavis, Local Chaos, Ampangook, Gemma Chitham.